Hi everybody, Sandy Bonani, welcome to my channel. I'm Alam Guntan, I'm glad and on this channel, Facebook, I'm a reality show, it's a lion's and the best is a lot of cool man, I'm a show, I'm a review, I'm a recap, I'm a show, 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 i am a show 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 i am um, notification. Kona le notification le ekamuga yo iti pop before it says pop of pop culture. <laughs> before it completes the sentence pop of pop culture, you are, you are pressing on it before it finishes saying, because now I do this. My girl is it's press and I go there. Okay. <laughs> of course, I did uh, a review of Musaka Wula's first video here on YouTube, which other people are saying it's not really his first video he used to post on YouTube. So I don't know why we're making a big deal about it. But let's just pretend that he never used to post on YouTube. It's the very first time because I don't know why we're making a big deal about it if he was here on YouTube before. Okay. So let's say it's round two. Okay. So I did the review if you want to watch uh, um, what my thoughts were on his first video. He has posted four more videos after that, I think. And uh, you guys, I think with every video, you can see the improvement, improvement in the storytelling, in the quality. Uh, it really looks good. The only thing that is not changing is his shirt, but I'm not blaming him because this is like my fifth video with the shirt too. So I was like, you know what? If Musa Kaola can wear his black shirt for five videos, why not me wear my black shirt also? <laughs> Don't come for our black shirts, okay? Just let us be, okay? Anyway, you guys, so he is finally here on your show. One thing about Musa Kaola is that the creators, you know, the, the consumers of his uh, content are mostly creators, okay? I don't think that there's... And I know Joseph Chup is definitely uh, watching because she has made some videos about it. I know and Ibuti is watching because she, has, <laughs> she made a video uh, on how they felt about his first video. There's many other... I think um, uh, Sip and Relax may, uh, made a video too. And there's, uh, more, there's more creators that have made videos. So I feel like really like... Uh, cre fellow creators are actually consuming his content so we are watching i'm not the only one that is uh watching him you guys and i feel like with every video he's moving uh towards uh the most the twitter musa because it's like okay i can see he's moving towards it but now he's starting to drop uh you guys and i'm interested to to see how it goes for him uh on youtube especially because he sounds like he really does not like using the word allegedly <laughs> <laughs> that is not his favorite word at all and it doesn't sound at, at times it doesn't sound like he's forgetting to say allegedly he just he doesn't allege ah no he doesn't allege so guys of course oh my god his channel has grown uh, so much from like 6000 i think he's over 10000 uh 12000 right now which is like double what he was before he posted the first, the first video that is not really his first <laughs> so and the the views i think with the views is really doing well you guys i think that he is okay detective samuel did a video uh and he said that his feelings about mosaka Ula is that the reason his his videos are doing so well right now and he's getting so many people subscribing to him is because of the excitement it's just the initial excitement people uh, are receiving him well on YouTube because they've been waiting for him for so long. But he feels like that is not uh, going to throw him into the hundreds of thousands. He says that he feels like when he probably gets to like the 40,000 or something, he's going to get uh, stuck there. I don't know, you guys. I his exp I understood his explanation. You know, I understood his explanation. I think for me, it just depends on the kind of content that he decides to give uh, moving forward. Because I I do think that 
even though he's doing of course he's doing it different and when you look at his comment section people seem to really like the way that he's pre presenting his content so it's hard for me to to know if it's going to be sustainable and take him into the hundreds of thousands but Mosa Kawala had a lot of followers uh, on Twitter you guys and since he cannot access Twitter right now people have been looking for a way to connect with him so those people might move uh, over to uh youtube you guys I, I i think i'm just gonna sit and watch and see how this goes but i understood um his uh, uh detective samuel's uh point of view when he said he just feels like for him he feels like it's just the initial excitement because people have been waiting for these videos uh for so long you guys i also was also wondering if uh Oam is going to be watching Umosakawula. Uh, because she did make that video to say that she will definitely not be watching Musa Kaula if Musa Kaula uh, comes to YouTube because she feels like it won't be that entertainment. She felt like Musa Kaula is boring when he's talking. Uh, also, she even made a comment, Yoguti, she feels like uh, the only reason she would watch Musa Kaula is if uh, Mamkiza pays uh pays people to watch we are not being paid guys maybe we should have waited until we get paid not to watch <laughs> why are we watching him for free eh? <laughs> so i wonder if he is watched if she is watching i think it's gonna tell you guys from the content because if she uses any references to musa kaola then it obviously she is watching but if she doesn't maybe she's really going to be uh, one of the few creators that are not going to be watching Musa Kaula because most, or let me say one of the few entertainment uh, creators that are not going to be watching Musa Kaula because it feels like most entertainment uh, uh, YouTubers are watching uh, Musa Kaula, whether they're just watching for entertainment or they're just watching to see if it meets the expectations or they're watching to get the content uh, from him but definitely it looks to me like everybody is uh, watching uh, you guys of course after some time guys the excitement is gonna die down and it's just now gonna depend on uh, the sky class that is gonna be dropping if it's dropping big enough sky class then it's gonna be <laughs> the fact that we are already subscribed and we already have the notifications so chances are He's still going to be doing well with the views as long as he can maintain the consistency that he started with. Because, yo, he came with a bang. I was like, Musa Kaula, Musa Kaula, Musa Kaula, Musa Kaula. So, yes. And he also doesn't look drunk when he's doing these videos. Even though in one of the videos he was having a beer, but he doesn't look drunk. Because on Twitter, sometimes he will sound drunk. Maybe he needs to drink so that he can drop this cutlass. <laughs> the bigger scatters. Anyway, you guys, that's all that I wanted to talk about today. It seems like it's going well. You know what? Entertainment uh, bloggers on YouTube have always, uh, for the most part, uh, uh, had the same stories that they do. And they've always done the stories different. So I don't think that other people's views are going to be affected by the presence of Kamusa Kaula. But I think that those people, they're going to watch the other vlog, uh, bloggers and they're going to watch Musa Kaul. I don't think that it's going to, it will be a surprise to me if they are affected. So, yes, it, it, this, this, this company is big, is big enough for all of us. Okay. It's okay. <laughs> anyway, you guys, that's all that I wanted to talk about uh, today. If you haven't checked out Musa Kaul's, uh uh, videos go and check them out if for nothing just so you know good to what have we been waiting for all of this time because we waited for long he was coming at the youtube for a very very long time anyway you guys thank you so much for watching this video please like it before you make share it with your friends with your family and even with strangers in a